other people. You're the last person on the tape, so say goodbye. It's the end. Today is June 5th, 1994. Hi, my name is Emily Dunn and I'm 12 years old. My best friends this year have been Christine Granger and Tina Servant. My best times this year have been just hanging out with my friends. The biggest pains about this year have been homework, my brother, and the most annoying teacher in the world, Ms. Davis. The best time in PF was the first class we had. The best thing about a PF group is being with people you hardly ever see all week. My advice to you is don't you dare laugh at my clothes or my hairstyle. Hi, my name is Katie Patterson. I'm 12 year old, years old. My best friends this year have been Christina Dalton, Melissa McGinnis, Stephanie Ramsby, Rebecca Hall, and Abby Worthington. My best times this year have been Christmas, my birthday, going on a retreat, and going to Bagley. Things that have bugged me the most this year have been my brother Cam and my teachers, Ms. Davis and Mr. King. My best times in PF this year have been to Bagley, Cedar Point, the retreat, and the game. Room. The best thing about a PF group is having somewhere to go on Sunday night. My advice to people watching this tape 10 years from now is give us these help clues. My name is Christine Granger and I'm 13 years old. My best friends this year have been Jenny Buxton and Emily Dunn. My best times this year have been being with this. my friends. I've been up for weeks. The thing that has bugged me the most this so year has been my brother. The most well. fun I had in PF this year was the last year. And there were lots of, you know, the best and thing about a PF group is doing sleep. group activities. So so my advice to you is to stay off drugs. I'm 14 years old. My best friends this year have been Sarah Patrick, Ginger Foster, and Heather Martin. My best times this year have been my entire age group, the fun. The thing that bugged me the most this year has been my job. The most fun that I've had this year in PF was at the lock-ins and all the other fun activities we've done. The best thing about a PF group is having fun and making new friends. My advice to people is 10 years, in 10 years is Take life one day at a time. You only get one chance. Yeah. Hi, my name is Sarah Patrick. I'm 14 years old. My best friends this year have been Kristen Farnham, Kristen Lutsky, and Sarah Barley. My best friends this school year have been at the school dance. The thing that bugged me the most would probably be the homework in school. And the most fun that I've had here at PF, well, well I've only been here twice, but Sorry, I've had a fun time. And the great best thing is that you always know what I'm at. And my advice to people 10 years down the road would be don't judge people for who they are outside. Look at the inside. And you have to be in your eyes. You have to be in your eyes. No, I'm lucky that it would be in your eyes. All right, Sarah. junior high PF advisor for three years and it's been a great experience because I have gotten to know junior high people and I never really knew any before and it's, uh, it was a great surprise to find out that they are real people and not just like um, overgrown rug rats you know that just get in the way it's very nice uh, it's been so it's been such an experience um, I think what I've learned most is that uh, the junior high kids are 
real people. I mean, they have thoughts of their own. They have distinct personalities. What surprised me is that the personalities of the junior high kids, you would never guess that this person was going to have this personality based on what you know about their parents or something. Every one of the junior high kids is such a unique and distinctive individual. And um, the, uh, the ones that go here at Plymouth that have been in PF, I have loved every one of them. They have just been, they have enriched my life. Um, what has, I, I think, surprised me is you hear about kids in, in the 1990s and uh, how they might be uh, alienated or, you know, looking for a place to belong since this generation is so much smaller than the baby boom generation and are they finding their identities? And I find that, uh, that uh, the kids are, are really very stable. They, uh, they have a good sense of what's important, what's not important, and yet uh, they're at an age where they have some free times and, and can have fun and let themselves free, you know, let, let themselves loose to be free, which, which older people can't do. And I, and I, I must say that, uh, you know, talking about broken homes and everything, the, the, my experience with the youth at Plymouth had been that uh, even those that don't come from the traditional nuclear family have uh, come from very stable, loving environments. And, and I feel very good about, uh, about junior high kids and, and what they're going to be as, as they grow older. This has been a terrific experience for me. Uh, I look forward to being active in youth ministry at Plymouth for a long time. I'm not going to be the PF advisor anymore, but uh, I will carry on in other capacities. And uh, you know, maybe a while after a while, I'll be PF advisor again. I, I don't know, but I now I'm going to be moving on to other things uh, with with the youth. But uh, I have discovered them, and I love them, and I plan to work with them. Thank you. under the name of the person you're going for. And that's it, that's the order that they're in. You two. Oh, that's okay. Christine, Christine, Kristen, and Sarah. Hey, give, give Dennis a, a, a smile. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, how are you, how are you voting? Ooh. There's a tie. It's a tie between you two. No, I haven't voted yet. Oh. Yeah. My smiley faces turn on the No, not really. No. Now we're finished. Yes. Oh. The winner is Christian Farnham. Oh, right. Okay, and here's your prize, Kristen. And it's up to you whether you share this with anybody. It's four yeah, packs of Bubblicious gum. You owe me some. Uh, Jam is kind of just That's all right. Okay. <laughs> you put everything back in the basket. It's, <laughs> it's juicy and food.